So if you've ever had one, you know traffic tickets often come with hefty fines sometimes, but we have one tonight that without a doubt sets an all-time record. Oh yeah, <laughs> Fast Track has ordered a customer to pay a fine that has to be the biggest for any ticket, anytime, anywhere. It's unbelievable. <laughs> seven on your side's Michael Finney is here with the story. Oh, it's so big, only seven on your side could deal with this drama. <laughs> I've received a lot of complaints from drivers who say Fast Track mistakenly charged them for crossing a bridge without paying the toll. Sometimes it's true, sometimes it's not. But this time, an Oakland woman got a toll violation with a fine so big, it would bankrupt a billionaire. We have determined you are responsible for the violation. Lori Mazurik of Oakland often gets these fast track violation notices. I respond by writing a little note saying we are a fast track customer. She says it's because her fast track device often doesn't work. She always appeals and fast track cancels the fine. This time, however, she received a bizarre demand from fast track. I thought, am I in candid camera? Like, is somebody playing a joke on me. As usual, Fast Track agreed to forgive the penalty if she paid the toll. However, the toll amount was staggering. I had to count the commas and say, thousand, million, billion. Okay, this is a hundred and thirty billion dollar Fast Track violation. Sure enough, here's the bill. It says the amount due is one hundred thirty billion, four hundred fifty nine million, four hundred sixty seven thousand and ten dollars. Lori nearly flipped. Then I thought, no, this is a very enormous, ridiculous <laughs> error, and then I started laughing at it. Not to worry, she had 15 days to come up with the money, and she could put it on her credit card. We accept Visa, Amex, Discover, and MasterCard. <laughs> this was so crazy, Lori decided to post the letter on Facebook. Her friends had a lot of fun with comments. Some of the funniest ones were the people who actually took the time to calculate how you would incur this kind of a toll. One friend said she'd have to cross the bridge four times per hour for 744,000 years. Another said it would take 5,017,000 toll crossings per week for a whole year. Others said you have fixed the budget crisis. So I called Fast Track and I told them, you know, we got this bill for 130 billion of dollars, you know, and they were totally on face. Fast Track said ignore the bill, but Lori was concerned. What if there were other mistakes? One of my Facebook friends, she said, oh, you have to call seven on your site. Lori did contact us. She also found a big clue to explain that big bill. It's right up here, what says TEV number. She shows us the violation number, 130-459-467. The same digits shown as the amount due. So that big dollar figure was really the violation number typed in the wrong place. We told Fast Track about this. A spokesperson traced the problem, telling us the incorrect huge amount was due to a customer service representative's copy and paste error. And not to worry, she didn't have to pay $130 billion. It was good for a laugh that day and for a number of laughs afterwards. As for those repeated violation notices, Fast Track says one of the family's cars was not listed on their Fast Track account, so the system didn't recognize the license plate. Now, Lori says she's going to examine all of her notices carefully to catch any cut and paste errors. Wow. Whew. <laughs> Sounds like she just weaseled out of a legitimate fine. <laughs> that is crazy, That's Michael. Funny. Thank you.